Apart from the PicKit 3, which uses the standard HID driver in both MPLAB 8 and MPLAB X, our other tools use proprietary bulk USB drivers with MPLAB 8. On the Windows platform, we have moved away from these proprietary drivers and instead have embraced the open source WinUSB driver for MPLAB X. If you've previously installed MPLAB 8 on your computer, the tools will be set up to use the old proprietary drivers. In order to use your tools with MPLAB X, you will have to switch them to the new open source drivers. Conveniently, we've provided a utility program to simplify the task of switching the drivers in either direction, depending on which version of the IDE you wish to use. The driver switcher utility is installed along with MPLAB X, and it may be launched from the start menu. Since microchip tools each have a unique serial number, each and every tool you use will need to be switched. This was done so that if you had more than one debugger, you could switch one to the new drivers for MPLAB X, while leaving the other to use the old drivers for MPLAB 8. Before you make the switch, it is important that you plug the tools into your computer first so that the current driver is loaded into memory. Failure to do so will cause the switch to be unsuccessful. Select the tools you wish to switch from the list on the left and choose which IDE you wish to use them with from the radio buttons in the middle. Then click Apply All, and the utility will exchange drivers for those tools. This change can take a while, so please be patient and let it perform its operation. Once it is complete, you can close the utility. Now let's look at how it will be represented in MPLAB X IDE. As you can see, I have both a Realize and an ICD3 connected to the computer, but only the driver for the Realize has been switched, and we can see that under the ICD3 it shows an incompatible driver because it's still using the drivers for MPLAB 8. If you need to change the tool back to MPLAB 8, just run the utility again and select MPLAB 8. For MPLAB X TV, I'm Rob Ostopyik.